Bacterial vaginosis, or BV, is one of the most common vaginal infections among women of reproductive age. Despite its prevalence, BV is often misunderstood, underdiagnosed, and mistreated. Understanding the causes, symptoms, and effective treatment options for BV is essential for maintaining optimal vaginal health. This comprehensive presentation will delve into the current epidemiology, causes, symptoms, and available treatment options for BV, as well as prevention strategies to reduce the risk of recurrence. What is bacterial vaginosis or BV? Bacterial vaginosis is a vaginal condition that occurs when the natural balance of bacteria in the vagina is disrupted. The vagina normally contains a mix of good bacteria, known as lactobacilli, and bad bacteria, called anaerobes. In a healthy vagina, lactobacilli dominate and help keep the environment slightly acidic, which is unfavorable for harmful bacteria. BV develops when anaerobes outnumber lactobacilli, leading to a decrease in vaginal acidity and an overgrowth of harmful bacteria. BV is not classified as a sexually transmitted infection, or STI, although it is more common in sexually active women. It can also occur in women who are not sexually active. BV is a significant concern because it can increase the risk of acquiring STIs and may cause complications during pregnancy. Epidemiology of Bacterial Vaginosis Bacterial vaginosis is the most common cause of vaginal discharge in women of reproductive age. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, or CDC, BV affects approximately 21 million women in the United States, representing nearly 30% of women aged 14 to 49. The prevalence of BV varies globally, with higher rates observed in certain populations, including African American women, women with multiple sexual partners, and those with a history of sexually transmitted infections. Despite its high prevalence, BV is often underdiagnosed because many women with BV are asymptomatic or have mild symptoms that they may not recognize as problematic. The condition can affect women of all ages but is most common in those who are sexually active, pregnant, or have a history of douching or using certain feminine hygiene products. Causes of bacterial vaginosis. The exact cause of BV is not fully understood, but several factors can disrupt the natural balance of bacteria in the vagina and increase the risk of developing BV. These factors include sexual activity. Although BV is not an STI, it is more common in sexually active women. Having multiple sexual partners or a new sexual partner increases the risk of BV, possibly due to the introduction of new bacteria into the vaginal environment, douching. Douching is the practice of washing out the vagina with water or other fluids. This practice can disrupt the natural balance of bacteria in the vagina, leading to BV. The CDC strongly advises against douching as a method of maintaining vaginal hygiene. Use of feminine hygiene products. The use of scented soaps, bubble baths, vaginal deodorants, and certain lubricants can irritate the vagina and disrupt the balance of bacteria. Smoking. Studies have shown that smoking is associated with an increased risk of BV. Smoking may affect the immune system and alter the vaginal environment, making it more susceptible to bacterial overgrowth. Lack of lactobacilli. Women who naturally have lower levels of lactobacilli are at higher risk of developing BV hormonal changes. Fluctuations in hormone levels, such as those that occur during menstruation, pregnancy, or menopause, can affect the vaginal flora and increase the risk of BV. Symptoms of bacterial vaginosis. BV can present with a range of symptoms, although some women may be asymptomatic. Common symptoms of BV include Unusual vaginal discharge The hallmark symptom of BV is a thin, white, or gray vaginal discharge that may have a fishy odor. The odor is often more noticeable after intercourse. Vaginal odor A strong, unpleasant vaginal odor is another common symptom of BV. Vaginal itching or irritation some women with BV may experience itching, burning, or irritation in the vaginal area, although these symptoms are less common. Burning sensation during urination. 
In some cases, BV can cause a burning sensation when urinating. It's important to note that the symptoms of BV can overlap with those of other vaginal infections, such as yeast infections and trichomoniasis. For this reason, it's important to seek a proper diagnosis from a healthcare provider if you experience any unusual symptoms. Diagnosis of Bacterial Vaginosis Diagnosing BV typically involves a physical examination and laboratory tests to assess the vaginal discharge. A healthcare provider may perform the following tests. Vaginal pH test. BV is associated with a higher vaginal pH greater than 4.5. A pH test can help distinguish BV from other vaginal infections. Microscopic examination. A sample of vaginal discharge may be examined under a microscope to look for the presence of clue cells, which are vaginal cells coated with bacteria and are indicative of BV. Whiff test. A small amount of potassium hydroxide, or KOH, is added to a sample of vaginal discharge. The release of a strong fishy odor upon adding KOH suggests the presence of BV. Effective treatment options for bacterial vaginosis. BV can often resolve on its own, but treatment is recommended, especially for pregnant women or women with symptoms. The primary goal of treatment is to restore the normal balance of bacteria in the vagina. The following treatment options are commonly used to treat BV antibiotics. Antibiotics are the standard treatment for BV. The most commonly prescribed antibiotics include metronidazole, also known as flagyl, available in oral or gel form, metronidazole is effective in treating BV by killing the overgrowth of harmful bacteria, clindamycin, also known as cleosin, available as a cream or oral medication, clindamycin is another effective treatment for BV, tinidazole, also known as tindamax, an oral antibiotic that is similar to metronidazole but may have fewer side effects. It's important to take the full course of antibiotics as prescribed, even if symptoms improve before the medication is finished. Stopping treatment early can lead to recurrence and antibiotic resistance. Probiotics. Some studies suggest that probiotics, particularly those containing lactobacilli, may help restore the natural balance of bacteria in the vagina and reduce the risk of BV recurrence. Probiotics can be taken orally or applied vaginally, although more research is needed to determine the most effective strains and dosages. Alternative treatments. While antibiotics are the most effective treatment for BV, some women may seek alternative treatments. These include boric acid. Vaginal suppositories containing boric acid have been used as an adjunct treatment for recurrent BV. Tea tree oil. Tea tree oil has antifungal and antibacterial properties and may be used as a topical treatment for BV. However, it should be used with caution as it can cause irritation in some women. Lifestyle modifications. Making certain lifestyle changes can help prevent BV or reduce the risk of recurrence. These include avoiding douching and the use of scented feminine hygiene products, wearing cotton underwear and avoiding tight clothing, practicing safe sex, including using condoms and limiting the number of sexual partners, quitting smoking. Complications of bacterial vaginosis. While BV is usually a mild condition, it can lead to complications if left untreated. These complications include increased risk of STIs. BV increases the risk of acquiring sexually transmitted infections, including HIV, chlamydia, and gonorrhea. Pregnancy complications. Pregnant women with BV are at increased risk of preterm labor, low birth weight, and other pregnancy-related complications. Pelvic inflammatory disease, or PID, untreated BV can spread to the upper reproductive tract leading to PID, a serious infection that can cause infertility. Prevention of bacterial vaginosis. Preventing BV involves maintaining a healthy vaginal environment and avoiding behaviors that can disrupt the balance of bacteria. Here are some tips for preventing BV practice good hygiene. Wipe from front to back after using the toilet to prevent the spread of bacteria from the anus to the vagina. Avoid douching. Douching disrupts the natural balance of bacteria in the vagina and can increase the risk of BV. Use condoms. Using condoms during sexual activity can reduce the risk of BV by preventing the introduction of new bacteria. Choose unscented products. Avoid using scented soaps, tampons, and pads, which can irritate the vaginal area. Manage stress. 
Stress can weaken the immune system and make the body more susceptible to infections, including BV. Practice stress-reducing activities such as walking, swimming, meditation, and exercise. In conclusion, bacterial vaginosis is a common and often misunderstood vaginal condition that affects millions of women worldwide. Understanding the causes, symptoms, and treatment options for BV is essential for maintaining vaginal health and preventing complications. If you suspect you have BV, it's important to seek medical advice for an accurate diagnosis and appropriate treatment. By following preventive measures and maintaining a healthy lifestyle, you can reduce your risk of developing BV and promote overall vaginal health.